The time is 5.40 p.m. with the evening. The news headline. President Muhammad Buhari receives new APC member Femi Fani Kayodi in State House on the 16th of September 2021. The news in full. A former Minister of Aviation, Femi Fani Kayodi, has returned to the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC. Fani Femi Kayodi was presented to President Muhammad Buhari at the State House Abuja by the Chairman of EPC National Kiyateka Extraordinary Convention Planning Committee, CECPC, and the Governor of Yubi State, Maima Labuni, on Thursday. Governor Belo Matawali of Zamfara State was also in attendance. While speaking, Femi Fani Kayodi said he was instrumental to the defection of the Three People's Democratic Party, PDP. Governors to APC, the former spokesman of the PDP Presidential Campaign Council, who said he is a founding member of the APC, added that he had returned to the APC for the unity of uh, the country. And this had come into the news that uh, Femi Fanikayode has visited President Muhammad Buhari at the uh, State House today, 16th September 2021, and then following some rumors that the um, uh, FFK would actually uh, defect or had actually defected to APC. Uh, we know that sometimes ago uh, the, there was a news by Tanku that replied to Fayoshi that PDP and not FFK, that is Femi Fani Kayode, will collapse if it defects to APC. A chieftain of the People's Democratic Party and chairman of the PDP revival group. Malam Tanko Ibrahim has berated the former governor of Ekiti State, Mr. Ayodele Fayoshi, over comment that if FFK leaves the PDP, it will become politically dead. Malam Tanko Ibrahim said this in a statement made available to Vanguard on Tuesday. We recall that Vanguard had reported that Governor Fayoshi stated that he is 100% sure that Fani Kayode is not leaving the PDP, that if he eventually leaves, he will be politically dead as a frontline Nigerian. Reacting, however, to the statement, Tanku, a northern chieftain of PDP, said that Governor Fauci missed the mark on Fani Kayode's status as PDP leader. Governor Fayoshi has lost touch with prevailing realities in the party. How can you say Fani, Fani Kayode will be dead politically if he leaves the PDP? Fani Kayode had been a thorn in the flesh of the ruling party since the Buhari government came to power in 2015. If FFK leaves PDP, it is PDP that would die politically and not FFK. He is behind the strength and spirit behind PDP. He is the one that keeps everyone in the country that is opposed to Buhari going with his fighting spirit. Without FFK, APC will eat PDP for breakfast, Malam Tanko replied. Malam Tanko also condemns a statement credited to Ekiti as governor when he said Fani Kayode is not a day-to-day -day politician. Tanko said that how can you say someone who led a successful presidential campaign is not a politician. He has been in politics since 1990. He grew up in politics. It is absurd to say such against a person of chief Fani Kayode, he stated. And this was reply of Tanko to Fayoshi after he has said that uh, if uh, Fani Kayode should actually leave the uh, PDP for APC that he would actually uh, be politically dead. And as a response now, uh, you know, Tanku had actually replied him that it is actually PDP that would actually die and it is not uh, uh, FFK that would actually, you know, be forgotten or be politically, uh, politically dormant at the end of the day. Sometimes around February, February in 2021, uh, FFK, the former aviation minister, had actually denied Governor Yahya Bilu's claim that he has joined the ruling party of All Progressive Congress. Governor Bilu, while addressing members of the party on Wednesday, said that Fani Kayode joined the party in good faith toward his positive energy. He said that Fani Kayode, a founding member of the party, had actually decided to leave due to misunderstanding and then approached him that he would like to join the party. According to him, he said that Fani Kayode has seen the light and it is a mandate to sanitize, mobilize, and educate Nigerians, irrespective of their background. 
Fanny Kayode countered this assertion in his reaction, stating that he had not left the PDP, uh, People's Democratic Party. He actually tweeted this on Twitter, saying that though we have had meetings across party lines, we are in a season of political consultation, but I have not left the PDP. And these were the words of um, Fanny Kayode as at of February 2021. But now uh, it is... You know, now a thing of uh, openness that uh, Femi Fani Kayode had actually uh, been received by President Muhammadu Buhari at the State House today, uh, 16th, 2021, and then um, with alongside with Governor Matawali of uh, Zamfara uh, of Katsina State, and then um, some other governors who actually introduced Femi Fani Kayode to the president of the nation today and it seems that the APC are actually happy to have Fanny Kayode, one of the strong uh, pillars of uh, PDP, uh, PDP to have defected back to APC. Although sometimes in 2014, uh, Femi Fanny Kayode actually, you know, defected from APC to PDP and then, um, you know, as, a, as at that time, there, there, was, there were write-ups around by one Oguntu Yimbu or Lani Waju in that 2014, when they actually said that he never liked the person of any Fanny Kayode, that their spirit does not even go uh, together, that he believes that he's fake and he's a talkative looking for relevance, that he, he, he had once tweeted against him sometimes last year, telling him that he's not convinced about who he's claiming he was, and that day Femi Fanny Kayode actually blocked him. He said he just believed that FFK is in a snitch, yeah. That he, he, he was actually assessing the reason for him purported to return to PDP. And the issue is, was he ever a member of APC? That can he actually produce his APC membership card or sleep? And he just posted on Facebook that he has joined the Progressive Party, that he had left the darkness and is now uh, with APC. And he wrote before then that he was chilling at the poolside in the home of APC national chairman uh, and national leader, Bola Tinobu, who resides in Bodilion, Ekorodu. Uh, and as at then, there were a whole lot of um, uh, views about him uh, actually exiting from APC. Uh, though he has sent messages around that he was still APC as that 2014, but uh, they said that it was actually uh, a strategy for him to be, have been appointed by, by the good luck Jonathan as that 2015. Uh, 2015. And, um,